broken, you made a way where there was no way. And I believe I'll see you do it again. I'll see you do it again. Make me through the waters, walk me through the fire. What you were famous for, what you were famous for Shut the mouth of lions, bring dry bones to life And do what you were famous for, what you were famous for So, what's God famous for? Is it parting the Red Sea through Moses? Is it taking down Goliath through David? Is it bringing uh, the dry bones to life through Ezekiel? Is it causing the lions not to devour Daniel? Which one is it? Another question. Do we just look at this as fables and leave it there, thinking the same cannot happen in our current days? Well, it all requires us to do the same thing that all these people did, to just call on God, our helper. Psalm, one, Psalm chapter 50, verse 15 says, Call upon me in the day of trouble. I will deliver you and you shall glorify me. So indeed, we need to let God be part of our lives so that we can experience his greatness in our lives this day. We need to acknowledge the fact that God has given us the liberty to be the drivers of our lives. But then again, we definitely need him in the shotgun space as we are riding this life. Uh, by shotgun, I basically mean the person who just sits next to you. I think this is a term that was coined back in the 1900s when um, the shotgun used to ride with a driver of a stagecoach so that he could uh, shoot any um, people who tried to interfere with their journey. And so we see that he played a very important role in that he kept the driver company and was also able to ensure safety for the driver. So in the same way, we need to ensure that we walk with God, that God is constantly there in our lives so that we can always call on him whenever we need this help in our lives. Indeed, he has done it before. He's, he has done very many things that we keep on talking about. We keep on uh, reminding ourselves about them each and every day. And he can still do the same things and even greater because our God cannot be limited. And our God can even do greater things than those that he has already done before. So today I dare you to try him. And I, call, I dare you to try and just call upon his name. And indeed, he will come through for you. God bless you. I've seen you move. You move the mountains. And I believe I'll see you do it again. You made a way where there was no way. And I believe.